LTE is the long-term evolution of the three GPP wireless standards that gave us wideband CDMA and now HSPA third generation connectivity. LTE is a fourth generation of wireless communications technology that brings to the, uh, the standard OFDMA modulation which allow the operator to use the spectrum much more efficiently to deliver high-speed broadband to the mobile user while making good use of existing infrastructure and back-end equipment. So it allows an improvement in broadband connectivity um, with less uh, capital investment in improved infrastructure. The um, higher speed uh, gives the user a connectivity that's much more like what you would find in a wired land environment in the office or the home and also improves the broadband connectivity at, uh, at mobile speeds in cars and trains and the like. Um, for the operator, it, it enables the delivery of more differentiated types of applications, uh, things like mobile media, multimedia, simultaneous voice and data, that and will improve the, uh, the financial picture for many operators in the fourth generation. The market for LTE devices is at a very early stage today. Although there are over a hundred operators who've made commitments to developing and, and deploying LTE networks, only three are actually lit up today. Um, later this year in the United States, Verizon uh, Wireless will begin deployment of an LTE network in selected metro areas, and Metro PCS has already lit up a, a network in Las Vegas. Going forward, um, we expect that the market for LTE devices will grow from a 10 to 20 million unit of data devices like USB modems to well over 150 million units a year by 2013 or 2014 and continue to expand the way that the demand for 3G systems, uh, smartphones, handsets, and of course data devices has driven the market for wideband CDMA products in the last few years. Anadigix is developing a leadership position in the gallium arsenide power amplifier space. The power amplifier is required in mobile 4G devices to amplify the signal that gets from the mobile user's device to the tower and the help products that we're developing provide the power and the linearity required to handle the more demanding OFDMA modulation while still providing a good power consumption and minimizing the amount of battery drain. We work with uh, chipset suppliers like Qualcomm and some smaller ones like Altair and Vseem to provide power amplifiers for reference designs that are used by many manufacturers in the development of their 4G devices. Going forward, Anadigix is developing a line of products that will cover all of the many bands in which LTE will be deployed and be able to provide the power amplifier needed for networks that are deployed around the world.